Hey there, water sign. How y'all doing? Oh my God. We are doing your, <laughs> your water sign reading, Cancer Pisces Scorpio for July 6th. July 6th. It is very, very, very warm here. And I am um, proceeding to bottle this energy, this this lovely heat, so I can uncork it in February when I'm like, damn, it's cold outside. Right? One is only as happy or unhappy as one imagines. That's true. Okay, so we're looking at you. What's going on for you guys? For water sign. Do you look through the, are you a half glass half empty, glass half full? Get a bigger glass kind of person? Make more pie. I'm a make more pie kind of person. All right, water sign, let's see what's going on with you. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for your twin flame soulmate relationship right now. Queen of Pentacles, lovely, nurturing, fabulous, warm. I love that. That feels good. Oh, dear. <laughs> that feels good. What are you doing, dude? Oh, my God. Lots of finger pointing going on here. What? All right. There's some, uh, there's some issues here, my loves. Somebody feels overwhelmed. Yeah. Okay. So, Queen of Pentacles... This is the energy that's necessary here, feels to me, like um, Seven of Wands, Resistance, Seven of Cups, Confusion, um, but doing the work. I like it, Water Sign. You're focused on uh, doing something. Uh, so if you're confused and, and you're in a situation of sort of battling with somebody about something, about whatever. Right, you're, you're, it's almost like you're blindly flailing at this person, but you are doing the work of this. You are trying to figure out what's going on with you, what's going on with the relationship. You are trying to figure it out, okay? You're doing the work. Wax on, wax off. You're not living up here in this uh, fantasy land, but you are resisting making a decision. Some of you are resisting making some kind of decision. Could be about a work situation, a pentacle situation, a, um, a stability situation. You're concerned, you're making choices that are going to impact your stability. This Queen of Pentacles here is very much about the stability thing. And you're sort of, hmm, not there. Well, that's not true. You are there. But something is going on here. I just want one. Seven of Wands, Seven of Cups energy here. Resistance, confusion, strength. Good. You can overcome this. I like that. I like that a lot. That makes me feel better about you guys. Okay? So, the person you're connected with, Justice, Six of Pentacles, Moon. Okay? Justice, the opposite energy, the moon. Justice is very clear. The moon is very murky. They want something that is going to be e balanced and equal. Like, uh, they want a decision that if you're looking, Seven of Cups is I'm trying to make a decision here. If you're trying to make a decision, they want something that's fair and balanced. They want something that's equal for both of you. Justice, Libra, right? Very balanced. The moon is sort of confused. So both of you feel in confusion here. You look like you're going to overcome this. The, the moon thing is, like, they don't know which way to turn. They just want something to be, they just want to find peace. All right? Peace of mind, especially. Because this is a, a justice in the moon is all about confusion in the mind. Queen of Swords is here nicely. So if someone was overwhelmed, overburdened, they went to the, they went to the hermit or the hierophant in the cave looking for guidance about where to move forward to and now we're getting clear about how, what to do justice queen of swords we're going to get clear here about where we want to go there's been no decision made yet there's still some confusion that needs to be cleared up what about this queen of pentacles here 
What's that? A man. Okay. One about the moon. Seeing things from a different perspective. The moon. Gotta gotta look at it differently. Five of Pentacles. Okay. So water sign. This person is worried that it won't be equitable. Okay. They're confused and they see a negative impact to themselves. When a decision is made, they, they're they afraid it's not going to be equitable for themselves. They're afraid that they're gonna get the short end of the stick, the fuzzy end of the lollipop, right? That's what they're afraid of. And it's I think it's great that there's too much responsibility here. There's too much, it's overwhelming, it's heavy. And I think it's great that somebody went to the Hierophant Somebody went to their pope. Somebody went to their priest. Somebody went to their lawyer. Somebody went to the, somebody who's right. They went to someone who gave them guidance. Both of you did. You might have gone to a therapist. You might have gone to somebody who had some special skills that they will help you navigate through this. You can see things from a different perspective. Maybe you're going to counseling to un, to clear up this um, energy about what's confusing the both of you because you do get clarity that's clarity man that is it this person has been feeling out in the cold here they have felt um they have i mean justice is like they're in charge of their own they don't feel but they do feel like they're gonna have to leave this behind they do feel like they've been left behind or they're gonna have to leave this situation behind this hanged man here for the Queen of Pentacles, it's like seeing things from each other's perspective is what gives you clarity. You're seeing things from each other's perspective. So there's not as much confusion. That's what clears up the confusion is this hanged man. And it's a nurturing energy. It's like, it's not like a fighting energy. Although the, although you feel, I feel like you're fighting. I feel like you're right strength is overcoming this there's a lot of masculine energy here justice is more airy it's more like I've made a decision right it's very clear like the queen of swords they're just afraid that they're gonna you know get tossed out in the snow okay all right I'm gonna do an extended read for this July 6th water sign uh, click on the link below you can check it out on the other side see you there